and then our next show starts at 3.30, right, Azure? Yes. And that'll be over at mid-shift. Azure, do we need help getting chairs over today? Possibly. I might just move my car back over here and put them in and take them All right. Well, yes, if you would help us you know, collect up the chairs and get them out to be able to, that would be super helpful as well. Um, if you want any water or any coffee, uh, we have that available uh, for a dollar a piece. And how much is the book out for? Uh, for contributors, it's five dollars. For people who did not contribute, fifteen. Cool. Thank you. All right. Oh, um, and Carrie's poetry reminded me of something I heard about Saturn's moon Titan on the radio yesterday. Um, apparently it is so cold there that all the water is completely frozen and acts like rocks. And the only thing that is liquid that actually forms multiple lakes on the moon Titan is gasoline. Nice. So think about that for a moment sometime. Anyway, anyway, <laughs> I'm pretty sure the squirrels would not be very uh, <laughs> entranced with that idea. Well, I mean, if it's a planet of gasoline, it's, a, it's amazing. Our government hasn't started the war there yet. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm sure it's coming. That'll be World War III, <laughs> Interplanetary War One. <laughs> All right, any other announcements to make of any of you? Carrie, okay, yes, blog cards. Carrie, are you still doing the um, newsletter as well? Or is it the blog? Yes, I just haven't gotten that. Okay, so if you would like to at some point be part of Carrie's newsletter to find out about all of the literary things going on in Northeastern Ohio, talk to Carrie. <laughs> all right, well, let's give it up for Icon Gallery for having us here. <laughs> Seven PM. Seven PM over at Avenue Arts at the lower level of Kathleen Holland Theater. If you need to eat anytime this afternoon, there's lots of really awesome places. There's Basil Asian Bistro at Sixth and um, Market. There's also on market there's uh, Napoli's Italian Eatery. It's right next door to it. It's relatively new. It's called Street Side. They have the most amazing black bean and sweet potato tacos ever. <laughs> And um, if you're more looking for like coffee, beer, and waffles, there's a uh, bunch of coffee, tasty waffles over here on Cleveland Avenue at the Garden Court. There's also Luca, if you like to keep things are kind of more upscale. And I'm not sure if uh, Buzzbin is having their Macho Naco taco truck Possibly. this afternoon. They're, it's usually an evening thing, I think. Yeah. So you can check in with them and find out if they're serving tacos and at what time today. Um, George's. George's, yes. George's is a bar that is known for having the most amazing bar food you'd ever ask for. So it, and people go there literally just for the food too. And Arcadia. And Arcadia, yes. Arcadia has been in downtown Canton probably longer than Napoli's has, which is like 25 years. So uh, Arcadia is right over there. You can almost see it from here. So um, they're off Fort Street between uh, Fourth and Fifth. Really close to our canopy. Sorry. Really close to our canopy. Yes, yes, very close to the canopy. Um, so yeah, there are a lot of uh, traditional American cuisine. All right, well thank you to everyone for coming and have a great afternoon.